It isn't often that we have the opportunity to restore a natural lake in the middle of a dense urban city such as San Francisco. So this ambition for the Presidio is an important example of urban ecology that aims to create and protect healthy ecosystems right in the middle of our cities, which is where most people in the world live. Mountain Lake is the only natural lake in the Golden Gate National Recreation Area. Although at one time Mountain Lake was ecologically healthy, it became very sick. Now we're putting energy into helping it heal. The goal of restoring Mountain Lake is to reintroduce native species that have been lost and to restore a vibrant ecosystem. So the planning for Mountain Lake began in the mid-1990s when the community began to grow increasingly concerned about what they were seeing going on out at the lake. The first problem was the shallowness of the lake. The Pershing Tunnel was cut in the Presidio and that soil was brought down and it filled about 40% of the lake and Highway 1 was built on that 40% of the lake. Decades of use by the community was limiting the amount of vegetation that could grow in the lake and increasing the amount of sediment that was going into the lake. And over time, as all of the sediment had moved into the lake from the surrounding landscape, it had gotten very shallow to the point where it could no longer sustain healthy life. The second was the quality of the water that was flowing into the lake. All the storm water flowed off Highway 1. Tannins that were flowing out of the eucalyptus trees all that grass fertilizer flowed off the Presidio Golf Course. All of those pesticides were flowing in the groundwater down into the lake and really messing with the ecology of the lake. There were a couple of swans that lived at the lake that the community was very fond of and one of them had died of lead poisoning. And we discovered other chemicals that you would normally not find in a natural lake. Suddenly it became a remediation site. It meant that we had to go through a much more elaborate process. Also, here at Mountain Lake, non-native turtles and fish drove out native fish and amphibians through predation. And they don't allow the lake's native aquatic vegetation, which is crucial to the lake's health, to establish itself. So far, we've removed all the buildup of sediment and toxic chemicals in the lake. We've removed most of the non-native fish and turtles that have been dumped in the lake over the many decades. We've restored and created new upland habitat for the turtle and amphibian species that we will reintroduce there. And we've already started to reintroduce the submerged aquatic vegetation that will anchor the entire ecosystem. We're rolling out a pledge campaign. One gets a cute sticker with our ambassador animal, the western pond turtle, which involves an oath of letting wildlife find their own food, of not abandoning pets at the lake, and also sharing what one learns about the wildlife at the lake with friends and family. This is a project that can have influence on urban restoration projects around the world. It can provide both the inspiration and the information to continue to do this great work that's so vitally important in our cities to connect the human world with the natural world and prove that we can coexist in a really healthy way.